The photos have just come through and oh my god, I love them so much. Still doesn't, oh my god, this is my favorite. Mental, absolutely mental. The difference in my face slash hand is ridiculous so bad hello guys and welcome back to the vlog i am just chilling here um doing a shit ton of work because that's what i have to do and that's what i get for not replying to any emails for like two days yeah i'm f like i've just picked the up the cap i've just picked up the camera now <laughs> to say like i'm struggling like a lot right now but this is what we go through, this is the process, and sometimes you're gonna get like this. You're sometimes gonna, you're gonna be stuck in between shows, like I am now, where there's no real room to fuck up. Like, there's no real room to kind of have a break. I had a break in Alicante where I kind of just went out and did anything. Um, and ate anything. Now my body craves it because it's in my system. My body thinks I want sugar when I don't. Um, so I'm like struggling right now. But, it's fine. We'll get over it. I think a lot of people, it's interesting to see what people are like in between shows like this time because a lot of people always think automatically, yeah, you're gonna be so motivated because you've just got your pro card to get straight back on it. Whereas I'm finding it really, really hard. I know this week is gonna be really hard and tough because I'm just gonna want all the foods that I'm not allowed on my plan. So, but it is what it is. I am gonna have a nap because I'm so tired right now. Um, so I'll see you guys in a bit. Good morning from horrible, rainy, gloomy England. Sorry I look a mess as well, I've just literally just done check-in. I went down this morning, which is really good. Um, I went to the steam room and the sauna yesterday um, to try and sweat out some water that I'm holding because I, I was holding quite a bit of water around my midsection and stuff, but I felt a lot better today. It went up to 60.9, which wasn't that bad, and then yesterday it went up again to 61.9 because my digestion hasn't been really good. Um, so I did take some laxatives yesterday to try and get my bowels moving. So today I am 61.3, so I've gone down, which is good. And I'm actually 0 0.1 of a kilo down from like this time, last time, if that makes sense. So last time I was this time far, I can't speak. This time, this far out, I was 61.4. So now I'm 61.3, so I'm pretty much back on track. I'm just holding a little bit of water still, um, but nothing a sweet cardio session can't fix. So I'm excited. But yeah, um, I'll see you guys in a bit pretty much because my brain. My brain's not working right now. <laughs> today, 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 cardio has been cut down and I am going to Crayford Waits today to go and see Jen Bliss, um, which is a posing coach. So I'm excited to go and see her and she's also an IPB pro. So it'd be cool to kind of swap information um, about the IPB pro league and kind of like get a posing routine together as well which is what we're doing for my show in the next seven, uh, eight days. So I'm excited. Today, cardio has been cut down to 35 minutes because my weight has gone down another half a kilo. So my water is pretty much like gone now. So coach is ad adding in carbs as of tomorrow and he's taking away cardio. Boop, boop. Yeah, I'm feeling really good, like energy and stuff and mindset today is so much better than what it was a couple of days ago. I think it's because now that I know I'm seeing the progress and I'm seeing the water like come off my body now and I'm not actually craving any sweet stuff anymore because that was making it more difficult for me to kind of like stick to plan because I think it was on, cause it's, what was it, Friday today? It was Thursday yesterday, Thursday yesterday I had a few cravings and then I think it was only yesterday that I actually fully didn't have anything off plan. Wednesday I had like a little, a few little treats like Oreos and stuff. Tuesday, well I was supposed to get back on plan on Tuesday, but I was being, I was being very difficult with cravings and stuff. So, but yesterday was a full day of like me not actually having anything off plan. But I'm excited, I'm happy, and I can't wait to get on stage again. So, but I'm excited to also like have a routine because 
with the pro stage you're allowed to kind of like really like milk your routine and you don't have like a set time obviously they're not gonna let you stay on stage for like five minutes or so but you they let you take your time with your um with your routine i didn't have a routine so i just made it up on the spot which i thought was very good for me by the way but i would like to have like a good routine to kind of like show off my best assets and like show off my best poses and that's why i'm going to someone so I, they can see what looks best on me um which is really good obviously i'm a posing coach myself but like it's also good to swap information from other posing coaches and have a second pair of eyes you know what i mean carbs are going in or up as of today so we've got 35 grams of oats instead of 25 grams we've got 140 grams of potato instead of i think i had 100 and then 90 grams of potato instead of 60 so that's what my carbs are looking like for the next couple of days or well for today so far um and then we'll relook everything tomorrow and see where we can go from there. And I also got these syrups sent through to me by Skinny Co. I think it's Skinny Food Co. And literally, I've tried salted caramel and they are, like, that one is delicious. I haven't tried these two. I'm going to try chocolate now and see what it tastes like. But salted caramel literally tastes like melted up sugar. Like, so nice. Usually these types of syrups taste quite artificial. But this one literally tastes like you're drinking pure sugar. It's so good. And literally nothing in them. No, no calories in them. They're all zero calories. So it's so good. Perfect for prep right now. But yes, I'm going to take chocolate and see what it tastes like. I'm a little bit scared that it's going to taste really shit. But let's give it a go. I'm not going to put up my oats straight away because I feel like it will ruin them if it's not great. Oh my God. Usually it tastes like these types of artificial ones, especially chocolate flavor always is really watery and like not nice at all. But that one is so nice. I'd give that a strong eight out of 10 for taste. That's really, really nice. I'm trying to eat as slow as possible because I don't want it to end. I'll put a link in the description box below for these syrups. They're only $3.99 a bottle. And I've got peanut butter as well, which I still need to try. And I've tried salted caramel, which is good. Me and Max are off to go and trade legs today. I had a posing session yesterday um, and it went really well. I've now got a pro posing routine, which is really cool. And it's weird to say that. I'm going to go to the gym today and practice it like a lot because I need, it needs to get in my brain that that's what I'm doing now on stage because last time I just winged it but last leg session going down today and Max is going to push me through it and go film some clips like fucking shit <laughs> uh I've, I've just so it like i'm ill i can you can hear it in my voice i'm ill and like just everything from like just here just feels like shit um 
I don't know how really it feels, I'm feeling really crap today. My weight's gone up today as well, which is never fun, because I haven't gone to the toilet. I don't think my, my stomach, I don't know, this morning my stomach's just like, feels, it's not bloated or anything, but it's just, it, I won't go to the toilet pretty much, that's pretty much it. I think my body's telling me like, this fever, you need to like, slow down a little bit. So, currently five days out, so, which doesn't, which makes things a little bit difficult. But I'm just about to go and train with Kerry, um, shoulders, which I really don't want to do. But I need to force myself to train with people because they push me. Because I feel like this, and I won't push myself otherwise, like, as much as I need to. It's just really, like, mentally draining at the moment, like... Even though five days doesn't seem a lot, like, I'm like, five days is so far away. Like, what I found out yesterday, which I think has kind of put me in a bit of a rubbish mood as well, is that this show isn't an Olympian qualifier, which I thought it was. So basically, you collect points for the Olympia. I'm currently on four points at the moment, and whoever's top 20 of that points system gets an invite to the Olympia at the end, I think it's the beginning of August. So I'm 37th right now. Um... So, I don't know if I will be able to go to the Olympia this year because I've got four points. So I need to gain about 20 points um, to po possibly get invited to the Olympia for this year. But yeah, it's just so, and I think that's why I'm a bit like flat today. But nonetheless, I'm still gonna push obviously for the win for this show or top three for this show because obviously it's my second pro show as an IFBB pro. So, but we're currently five days out. I'm ill, but we're gonna push and carry on. So yeah, my weight went up on Monday and you can clearly see I was not happy about it, to be fair. Um, and I didn't go to the toilet or anything like that. Um, and I woke up with a really bad cold. Then Tuesday it went down, which was good. And I think we added in a few more carbs that day. We added in, yeah, 45 grams of extra oats. That's when it got upped. And then yesterday we had the same, so weight was the same yesterday, yeah, weight was the same yesterday, but we had already upped carbs. And then today, my weight dropped by 0 0.9, so I was obviously 60.2 yesterday, and today I'm 69.3, and I, every time I have a big drop, I always message my coach, like, the number as in like the picture of a scale because I feel like he doesn't believe me and he was shocked so I was shocked as well like yeah again I feel a bit flat so that's why we also upped carbs quite a bit today so he was literally like whoa big drop let's eat up crazy that we dropped cardio add food and your weight drops so today instead of 45 grams of oats we've got 50 grams of oats oh we've got jam as well didn't realize that. Yeah, we've got 10 grams of jam added in as well, 220 grams of potato instead of 170 grams, and then we've got 15 grams of jam, and then 175 grams of potato instead of nine, instead of 110, 120, sorry. And then we also get 100 grams of potato in meal two, which for the last couple of weeks, I haven't had any carbs in my normal meals it's literally just been all around my workout so pre and post and post so that's really exciting that i get some carbs in a normal meal today today is just a normal day like i'm just going to work from home do client check-ins uh do a bit of youtube and stuff like that and then that's it today's thursday so i oh, know i'm going to get my eyebrows done and my nails done because they look ratchet as fuck right now yeah, um, let's just not talk about my nails. Mm, no. And then I'm gonna go to the gym for my last proper session. And then tomorrow's gonna probably be a fasted um, upper body workout like I've been doing um, every time. And then we get my hair done. And then we go to Coventry. Poor bush. So I'm like every time I get to like this point I'm so like I just get so excited all nerves like and this is when you truly know you actually love the sport for what it is and you're not doing it for the wrong reasons because all the nerves go and you're just excited to get on that stage to meet people to go and just have fucking fun like I can't I can't wait I literally can't wait because there's so many 
UK athletes that I haven't met for so long or haven't seen for so long and they're doing the show, the amateur show and everything and I was so excited and then there's at the pro show that I'm competing in there's girls that I've looked up to for like years since the beginning of like my journey and I'm going to be keep competing with them on stage so like to meet them and to just like be on stage with them is just such a massive honor so I'm just like so I'm just kind of like instead of thinking of them like competition like I'm like I'm honored to be on stage with you right now like I'm going to enjoy every single second of this so yeah I'm buzzing um oh I can smell with potatoes and they smell so bloody good so yeah that's those are my thoughts um at two days out look at all this potato post-workout post post workout and meal two which i'm just about to have now oh, i can't wait get in my belly mm. carbs have never tasted so good mm. oh the lighting's changed this is currently what I'm looking like right now. My veins have only just come come out right now. But this is the lean life. Madness!